Sean, one nil win against Braintree and you get the winner. Not a bad afternoon. No, great afternoon. You know, really pleased with that. Uh, massive three points, and just you know, I think we learned from the, the solid old game the other week where we got stuck in a bit more and just showed a bit more fight and then a bit more know-how. And uh, obviously, that's the important important thing. I said that after the solid old game, you've got to learn. You know, it's early doors, and we showed that today. We showed good good fighting spirit, and we uh, come away with a win. Yeah, it was a little bit comparable, wasn't it, to the solid old game? These are difficult sides to break down. Yeah. It's compact. They're on top of you as well, and it's just a hard-fought win, isn't it? Yeah, of course it is. You, you've only got to look at their score lines. They've not been. You know they've been in pretty much every every game, and I look look through the last six results. I think they've drawn a couple, and every other game was a goal by one one uh, a defeat by one goal. You know, apart from maybe one where they got beat two, and also it shows you they're well in games all the time. And small pitch, their keeper kicks it a mile. Yeah. Big physical side and up the top end, so it's always going to be you're going to have spells where you have to, you have to try and deal with it. Yeah, it's um it's such difficult places to come. You can see that that. We've learned from these mistakes. We've progressed, as the manager's been saying. He's still not happy where we are in terms of we need to keep stepping it up every week. Yeah, definitely. You know, I think just learning different ways. You know, we've got experience in the side, but more so at the top end. Apart from Bev, <laughs> well, let me saying that. You know, uh, Mike and Ricky and uh, and Jordan, they're a bit younger, you know, and there's other lads as well involved in that. But ones that were up there today, you know, just a bit of naivety and just towards the end, you see Ricky. Getting the ball in the corner, winning fouls, Jordan as well, winning yeah. fouls, winning throw-ins, or even if you give a throw-in away in the, in the far corner, it's, not, you, it's easy to defend if the ball, if you're defending a throw-in in the far corner, rather than maybe going for goal, the goalkeeper then can set it up and he's launching it back into, you know, he's launching it 25 yards from our goal. So I think just, just, yeah, just learn from that and that's that's good progression for us. So talk about the goal then. Um, great ball in again by Summers. Another assist for him, and I know the lad's been giving you a bit of um, bit of stick for not getting a goal yet this season. Yeah, well, we got it. I should have had five or six really. And I've had the one this lad in the bar, and a couple off the line. I uh, missed a sitter at Eastley, so I've been frustrated to be honest with you because I feel like I've got got my head on on the end of a lot. So uh, obviously delighted to get the goal and. Uh, Funny because Jeno called it just as I was going up. Like he said, he said he thought I was going to score just before. So, um, no, pleased with that, and uh, just pleased to win. To be honest with you, another clean sheet, which is obviously really pleasing, and, uh, and we're heading in the right direction. Quite nice for you today on a personal note. Obviously, your daughter in the crowd as well. So I know you're looking for for the celebration, and, and nice scenes at the end where you uh, where you got to go over. Yeah, to it's it. nice. You know, mum and dad don't live too far from here, so nice for them. They're here as well, so they don't get to come to as many games as they'd like. So no, it's nice today, and uh, I've had some torrid times at Braintree away in the past, so. Uh, it's uh, pleasing to uh, put them to bed. So you got this, and now we've got a full week to recover, and I guess that's much needed, isn't it? After such a, a difficult start in terms of yeah, the just probably same for every team, you know, yeah. just a busy period. And you know, you're starting to get a gist of where teams are now. Ten games in, you you have a rough idea. I'm not saying teams won't come up and move up, and teams won't at the top end won't drop down, but you're starting to get a, a more fair comparison in the league table, and, and we're really pleased with our start. 21 points is is really pleasing. It puts us in a good position, and. We'll look to push on now. Cheers, Sean.